Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? It's your friend, Neighbor Content Creator. I wanted to make another video about Yaimiko. Yes, guys, I'm going to be skipping Yaimiko. I know that sounds like a big deal, and well, for my account, it is. But the reason isn't because she's going to be necessarily a bad character. She's going to be a main DPS character that is going to be needing a bunch of support. And I he will keep saying this. I do not have the Ryan Shogun on this account. But this video is a little bit interesting because on this account, my free-to-play account or my second account, as I might say in the past, this is pretty important for this account. Now, I've been grinding Yaimiko's resources, such as her boss material, her talent books, whatever it may be. I did a lot of grinding on this account. As you guys can see here, I have 52 of the Dragon Airs Falls Thin, which means I have pretty much for an Ascension 90 Yaimiko on this account, and I spent so much resin on this. I spent so much resin on spent so much resin on the artifacts for her, which is now on my Kucho Sara actually. Spent a bunch of materials on the Black Cliff a gate just in case I wanted to do a crit damage, crit rate type of build for her. And all of that will be for now. Now the reason why I say is think I might skip Yaimiko on this account because I don't know. I don't have the Raiden Shogun on this account. I don't have a proper Electro team on this account. I don't have proper, you know, builds for her. Just might skip Yaimiko entirely on this account for another character in the future that's coming up not to mention i only have a certain amount of prima gems as you guys can see on my screen so i don't think i should just waste it on a character that i'm not going to be using often and you know as the main dps character she's going to be replaceable in the future so maybe i should not get her obviously Zhongli and ganyu are still here so if i did want any of these characters i could just you know temple get one of these characters and then use them such as you know ganyu ganyu would be incredible Zhongli would be incredible as well as a shielder but i already have Zhongli on my main account and this account is supposed to be you know not necessarily with archons or whatever but maybe Ganyu could be a pickup I have five days to consider this now I know this is gonna raise a lot of concerns because I did say in the past that I was going to be summoning on Yaimiko on my free to play account in a video I made but now I am reconsidering that fact and I might just be skipping Yaimiko on the free to play now I know a lot of you may be saying oh you could just run Fischl and Kujusara on the team and you'll be pretty much okay even though I have them built all the artifacts that I prepared for Yaimiko are on you know Kujusara but I feel like on my main account where I do have the Raiden Shogun where I do have Fischl where I do have Kujusara where I do have Beidou built where I do have whoever it may be traveler i built traveler on my main account as well so i could just use those characters on my main account to try to get yaimiko it's a little unfortunate that i will not be using yaimiko on this account but hopefully i do get her on my main account with a few summons because i currently only have a few on that account but yeah that's pretty much my sole reason on why i am considering you know not pulling on yaimiko but i do have 20 days when she does come out to reconsider if i wanted to pull her anyway to see videos i make out of my main account and you know just to see how she performs with or without the right and shogun then i can make a decision whether i do want her or not Obviously, I'm going to be trying her out in the trial run as well for both accounts in case I do want it or not. Now, the big thing about this account is I am pretty much at pity. So if I do go to the history here and I do look at this, I am pretty much there. There were 61 summons in and the last time we have summoned was on the Yoimiya banner. This was way back when... This is in August, the 10th of August. This is such a long time ago. And now we're here. We've got a bunch saved up for the next character. So we might just get a guaranteed character whenever we do need it. I'm going to be, you know, just saving up, see what kind of character I want in the future. And then hopefully we do get the character we want. Maybe a few constellations on that certain character. Or maybe we just save up some more. I don't know. We're going to have to wait and see what we do with this in the future but so if i do get lucky anyway she perform hopefully i do i can get her on my main account and that's where raiden shogun is kujasar is also there at c5 so maybe i can get her on c6 and eventually i don't really know but i really do hope it all works out on the other account but for now that is going to be it for today's video hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did consider liking this video subscribing to the channel as well it'd be greatly appreciated i'll see you guys in the next video very very soon